We do know that sometimes we get things that are way out in the future and things will change by the time they get here, but it is quite interesting to take a look at them early on and see how these things develop over time. It's just really fun to see in my opinion. But the first details regarding AMD's next generation Zen 5 based Strix Point Ryzen desktop CPUs and APUs have hit the web. And it looks like the successor to Zen 4 will have some big changes on both consumer CPUs and APU lineups. Information reported by MoPC states that while Zen 4 based Phoenix APUs are expected next year for desktop and mobility platforms, the next generation Zen 5 APUs are already in design and development phases. As per the rumor, the AMD Ryzen desktop APUs based on the Zen 5 cores will be known as Strix Point. Now the AMD Zen 5 chips will be fabricated on the brand new 3 nanometer process node whereas Zen 4 chips are going to be based on the 5 nanometer process node. Now the architecture is going to see a lot of changes in terms of design and it is stated by the source that AMD does bigger architectural revamps for its odd number Zen architectures while even number Zen cores tend to get better optimizations and it's stated that the Zen 5 based Strix Point APUs are expected to be part of the Ryzen 8000 series family but they're going to include one major change and that change is the inclusion of hybrid architecture design. Just like Alder Lake CPUs launching later this year, Zen 5 architecture is said to be the first to feature a big little-esque design. Now the AMD Strix Point Ryzen APUs are expected to feature 8 large Zen 5 cores and 4 smaller cores, but there's no information on what those cores would be. For Intel, they will be using their Atom x86 cores as the smaller cores which lack SMT support, while the bigger cores will be based on the x86 Cove architectures and feature simultaneous multi-threading support. Now, the first AMD Strix Point APUs are rumored to debut in 2024, but we could see a release in a desktop lineup launching earlier as mainstream CPUs get launched months ahead of the APU launches. Now the Zen 5 Ryzen CPUs and APUs are also set to feature some huge memory subsystem changes, so we can expect a new IMC and redesigned cache. Zen 4 desktop CPUs and APUs are going to introduce RDNA 2 GPU architecture on board, so moving forward we can see Infinity Cache subsystems for Ryzen processors as well. Now obviously it's still too early as we're talking about chips that are years away from launch, so expect the final specification change possibly quite drastically, but it will be interesting nonetheless to see a hybrid architecture from AMD to battle against Intel's mainstream lineup of CPUs. And I want to thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you like what you've seen here and you like getting news daily, make sure you hit that subscribe button down there in the corner. And if you've missed out on news in the past and you want to catch those, check out one of these videos over here.